Welcome to Two Old Farts Extras, stuff you've been missing because you're too lazy to listen or watch our show. Is to educate people and to help them learn how to use these tools and give them back the balance in their lives. Love it. I don't have time. This is, I think, the first time that I really started hearing that actually was when I moved up here. I remember that I had to schedule with my friends a lunch sometimes weeks in advance because they don't have time i was in shock i remember so vividly that i because i called all my friends at the time i didn't have that many that's true i was a bit of a loner in my beginnings in america for good reason um but yeah i remember sitting down in central park and everybody was busy for the next two to three weeks between you know fun things and work and i mean god knows what how is how is that possible that, yes, we end up not having time? You're right. This is something that definitely needs to be looked a little bit more into because at the end of the day, you're right. We all do have 24 hours, but nobody has time for nothing. Yeah. You know, if you want something bad enough, you'll find a way. But if not, you'll find an excuse. And there's been there's so many available excuses now, and we've we we kind of it's kind of like a, the mechanisms of addiction, right? Their uh, addiction is all based on mechanisms that happen in your brain. I think it's a combination of rationalization, minimization, uh, blaming, and all those. That's really what addiction is. And the same concepts are used it with time as well. We rationalize the fact that we don't have time. Yet, if I told you, oh, really? You don't have time to meet with me? Well, I was actually going to give you a car for free. Well, somebody yeah. said, hold on a second. Hold on a second. Well, let's work something out. So it's a matter of options. It's a matter of choices. And people prioritize. But they prioritize based on, I think, the wrong priorities right most people are trapped in this vicious circle um they're in either in debt or financially in trouble and they're forced to keep going they're forced to to exchange their time for money they're forced to achieve someone else's goals uh, instead of focusing on their own and it's a whole process and it's not it's not the same for everyone mm -hmm. but one thing that i want to tell you guys is, is is very important in this there's two different types of people on the planet when it comes to time and um, the system that I use that I really think is the best is the MBTI system. It's the Myers-Briggs. The, all the leading spy agencies use it. I mean, it's used in business. It's, it's, it's the best. There's nothing better. What and, is that? Uh, MBT? MBTI. MBTI. All right. Yeah, it's the Myers-Briggs type indicator. And okay. it's the most accurate system into being able to classify people based on their temperament and personality type. And uh, everybody falls into a system of one of one of 16 personalities. Four, there, mm -hmm. There's four temperaments, and in each temperament, there's four types. Four times four is 16. That's mm -hmm. the combination you get. But within that system, there's a category of planner, non-planner. And mm -hmm. uh, throughout the world, all 8 billion of us will fall into one of two 